When I came home from prison, <laughs> you just notice how all my stories start like that. <laughs> I went on a date and I was asked if I had a 401k and I, I didn't know what that was. I was like, well, what is that? My number is 67119. <laughs> She said, she was actually really upset. She said, you're not prepared for the future. Pre prepare, making someone ready or able to do or deal with something. In other words, I call it trained. We prepare for retirement, we prepare for vacations, we prepare for diets, we prepare for most things. Why is it that we don't prepare for heaven? Let's get into this video. What's up guys, my name is JC, I am Ron Strong. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe, hit that bell so you don't miss nothing. If you're part of the team, mi familia, mi raza, you already know what time it is. Suelta la suburba, cause we about to go see Jesus. What's up guys, welcome to another episode of Wrong Strong. All in your name, all in your glory. Thank you Jesus for what you did on the cross for me, thank you. When I went to go live with my grandparents on the south side of Chicago, I was in seventh grade. I started going to a school on 59th and Holman, Tanti, Tanti School. They were going to prepare us to not get killed by gangs that year. Uh, the class was about what colors to not wear, what colors that were safe, what colors weren't. And if you're from Chicago, you already know that every single color is taken 
by every gang there. You, and any, any color you could possibly think of. Pink, red, blue, it, it doesn't matter. They're all taken. Hats, what side it's turned to, right, left. What kind of stars you have on you, five point star, six point star. What kind of jackets, starter jackets were really big back then. Even lifting up your socks on one side or the other. Everything is gang related in Chicago. But even after all that preparation, six kids got shot that year. So how do we prepare for heaven? I don't know about you guys, but I'm looking forward and excited to be with Jesus. <laughs> We're gonna be like hanging out, working out. Just as, as a lot of people out here plan their future on earth, we can prepare for our future in heaven. If you really think about it, life on earth really is about getting ready. It's about accepting God's gift of salvation, recruiting others to go with us, and storing up our treasures in heaven. The most happiest place here on earth doesn't even compare to the ultimate place of peace, joy, and love for all of us that receive God's gift of salvation through Jesus Christ. Heaven is our future destination. How can we prepare on earth for living in heaven? Receiving Jesus Christ as your savior. Leave fear behind. Recruiting as many people as possible to go there too. We can't take anything from earth with us when we leave, but we can recruit loved ones and others to come with us. Store up your treasures in heaven rather than on earth. God's treasures are made to last in eternity. By doing good, being good, rich in good deeds, not in money, being generous and willing to help and share. When I was at the top of my game and I had business, the house, big truck, half a mil in the closet, and what you would call a successful, I guess, person here on earth. I, I can't ever remember being happy or experiencing some kind of joy or peace. It was like all a lie that almost cost me my life in hell. Yes, it is real, people. We just don't want to talk about it because we're afraid. Are you going to heaven or hell? Really ask yourself that question. My name's JC. I am Wrong is strong, don't judge nobody, stay in your lane, live savage, and remember, live for him. Trying to warn you, money back guaranteed. Catch you guys on the rebound.